Coley, three wins from three in the league at home. What do you make of your team's performance this afternoon? If you'd asked me about 25 past three, I was livid. Started off really well, made a couple of good chances, scored a really good goal, really well worked goal. Delighted for Joel to go after Mark, you know, he's been frustrated, missing chances, and you could see that earlier on when he took an extra touch when he should have got a shot off. And that'll do him the world of good. But then after that, we idled. Uh, I likened it, you know, I like my analogies, and I liked it, I likened it to it was swatted a bee, it was on the table, and we, we hadn't put it out of misery, we hadn't put it out. Um, we carried on playing, and eventually, if you carry on playing with a bee that you've, you've hurt, it'll sting you. And there was every chance that they were going to sting us. They dominated 20 minutes of the, of the first half, and uh, there was a few harsh words said at half time. And thankfully, he responded. Uh, still not quite where we want to be passing wise, but we started picking up more second balls, we started passing the ball better, we started making more chances. Second half balance of chances, we still made four good chances and we should have had a penalty and uh, you know, the keepers made a couple of good saves. Toby's palms one away from a cross and not really made a save. And in the whole game he's probably only made one save, so you've got to say we've defended well. But we're making ourselves defend because we're, we're sloppy giving the ball away, we're not passing through them, we're, we're, we're getting a little predict bit predictable going directly to Colby a bit too much. Um, if you're going to go to Colby, you've got to pick up the second balls, and they picked up the second balls in the first half. It was far more even in the second half, and that's why we won the game. You're also delighted to get the win, but is it also a bit concerning that we're not getting that second goal at times? Well, it is, but I know we're going to get better. You know, we've got Ethan Hamilton came on and showed a different dynamic to what, it, to what he's about and what that gives us an understanding to our ball. Um, obviously, Jovan coming on as well, you know, getting his first taste of of this, this type of football. Joel getting his goal, do, the world's are good. Colby looks like the top player he is. And that's why, you know, people are coveting him and that's why they'll be, they'll be queuing up for him in January. Um, just the top, top striker who leads the line unbelievably well. And he's better than anybody in the league, in my opinion. Um, and then we've defended well. So, Add to that, we've got our skipper coming back. We've got Joe Pritchard, arguably one of the most exciting players in League One. And John O'Sullivan, you know, who everyone knows, John will, will give us all, and he's an exciting attacking player. Uh, so all of a sudden, you know, in three or four weeks, we could we could have a really strong squad with a, a lot of young kids chomping at the bits to come and help us as well. And you spoke on Thursday about that return of fans, and I don't think it's any coincidence that since they have returned, we've won all, all the games here. How good were they today? They're magnificent. You know, they, they get behind them uh, from from north to, what was it today, 114 we played. So, um, you can never have a fault them and I hope they all have a great night in the uh, tent there. And you look at the club and the way that's coming on, uh, it's going to be a fantastic place to, to, to celebrate and hopefully we can give them things to celebrate about. And lastly, obviously, you'll have seen the cards before kick-off in Block C. Is that the perfect way to respond to the gentleman? Yeah, it's or? a little bit of fun, I think, from Dave Baird. You should... I said, no problem, mate, mate. He can, he can moan as much as he wants. I'm never going to say no, just the letters that I'm getting sent. Um, and I'm certainly not going to alter me, me way of thinking for me formations because someone suggests something to me uh, via post. Might be carrier pigeon next time, you never know. Uh, but now nah, it's water off as it's back to me, and it was more of a laugh to me than anything else. And lastly, it's too early to look at the table, but next Saturday, top against second. Lee Johnson was here today. It's set up to be a thriller. Yeah, and listen, the, you know, it, it's very, very early to get carried away with where we are in the league. We're happy with our points return from the first six games. I think anybody would be. So we've just got to keep batting away and and try and keep them averages up.